Oh boy, we got an excellent, excellent arcade adventure. But I want to see this story. Can you make sense of this? Whoa. Some secret island. Why is it skipping? There we go. Who cares? I'm just fucking around. I'm bored. I haven't done this in a while. I want to see if I can't get this shit waking. Oh shit. What the hell's going on? Thumbs up and shit? Six foot one and 155 pounds. What in the hell? All right, let's put some quarters in this turd. Round one of Riot City. What an adventure. Holy shit. Look at this. See that pecker head? I'm gonna get another pecker head. I'm gonna punch them all to their stupid heads. Look at this asshole. I really just wanted to see if I could get this shit working. So, don't expect anything exciting. This is a probably a dull game, but it looked like fun, so I thought I would try it. Alex S says hello. How you doing? I still want to know how that guy is 6'1 and 155 pounds and he's all big and shit. That don't make any sense. What an adventure. I'm alright. Just killing some time. Beating some fruits. Because that's what it's all about. And cowboy hats. And festive fucking cowboy hats. I haven't been able to stream in here forever because YouTube's all, all been, all, been all up in my asshole, man. Every time I want to do something, fucking YouTube is around the corner to fucking dry, <laughs> go in dry in my fucking anus. So here I am. Trying this after forever. Sup, man? Uh... 24 Ra Me SPS What a name What a name Motherfucker I'm not good at video games by the way So I don't expect that shit Punching An entire trash can And eating the delicious contents of said trash can Some of the best meals I've ever had Came out of a trash can. This is some shitty Sega game that we didn't get over here. Some arcade game. I don't know. Yo, Richie, what game is this? Says Graveyard Sale. This is Riot City. I don't know shit about it. I know there was a similar game for uh, the Toybo Graphics. But other than that, I don't know. Trying to smoke and play these games is a nightmare. <laughs> Look at this. They got nothing. So how's Beefneck doing? I don't know. She don't, you know, Beefneck don't show her face anymore. I can't do the fucking videos because she don't show her face. That's all right. You know, you after you make like 300 videos mocking every single one of her little cooking tutorials, it starts to weigh on your conscience a little bit. Uh, so whatever. I hope Beefneck is having a great time. But if you liked all those classic Beefneck episodes, they're all up for viewing on Daily Motion. Thank you. Those Look at those. Hi, <laughs> dudes. I get, it's cut off. Fuck. I gotta fix this. Hold on. Cause I gotta read it on the screen, and I have, like I said, I haven't done this in forever. So, how does that, does that work? Does that help? I don't know. I don't know if that helps. Let me see something else too while we're going. 
It's not playing, is it? Oh, it is playing. You motherfucker. That that kills my shit, man. Like I said, I'm out of practice. All right. Look at that guy. Sitting up there thinking he's better than me. Now I'm fucking something else up. Ugh, what a mess. Alright, hold on. I am so confused right now. Does that help? Let me see. Like I said, I'm just trying to get this waking. I had it perfect before, and then I fucked it up. What you ever see now my chat box thing is all messed up. Let's see we could fix this Oh wait, no This is see the the box opening up messed me up man All right, we got to find a happy medium here See, I just figured this chat thing out earlier, so you got to give me a break. Would you ever go, go into the ring against Beefneck? I don't know. That bitch is scary. All right, so let's fix this a little bit. Uh, properties. Give me two seconds, man. I'm out of practice. All right, how are we doing this? Is that better? Yeah! Good enough. Fuck it. We'll do it live, right? Alright. Would I ever go for the getting ring against Beefneck? No. Do a Richie's art corner on Trigglypuff? Wait, wasn't I just here? I should. I haven't done one of those in forever. My Labor Day? I didn't do shit Labor Day, man. Oh, I know what he did. I mowed lawns. It was a great time had by all. Not just one, two. What an adventure. I didn't do shit. All right, I probably made that chat box too big, but I'm just a tender little guy and I'll fix it in a minute. I just don't feel like doing it right now. I just got it set up and now it's fucking me again. I had it perfect before. Motherfucker. Oh, a turkey! Fuck yeah. And some perfume. Gotta smell nice when I'm beating some ace. <laughs> right, it own sucks ass. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I didn't play through it. This is this is all new to me. I'm sure I played it like in 98 or something. Motherfucker. Yeah. What kind of move was that? That's like some move you would see those fruits do at the Olympics. This is made by the same people that did uh, Streets of Rage. Figure that one out. It's even got the same gay football guy. What YouTube feminist do I hate the most? Ah, I don't even know if it's so much hate that you just realize it's just a bunch of cunts getting paid off by somebody. Here, be annoying. Here's some paychecks. 
pay you on that stupid Patreon. It's all phony, man. It's just some annoying gun playing a role. Because no one, no actually intelligent bitch really believes that stuff. That's not a teenager. I'm going with Jesse Ventura and saying it's reptilians. Prove me wrong. Prove me wrong that it's not reptilians. You can't. Ha. <laughs> can't beat the super gay twist. The super gay twist is unstoppable. Alright, look. Now it's getting on my now it's getting on my nerves, man. Now I gotta fix this. See now it's all out of whack. What can I do here? Motherfucker. Can you even still read that? I can't tell, man. <sighs> I think you could still read that. Tomorrow I'm going to my college and it is full. Why is it doing this? This is such, I can't read nothing. Was that it? Was that the fucking reason? Is everything in there now? No. I go back up. Fuck it, it's good enough. Yeah, but now? <sighs> I just set this up before and I'm like, yeah, this is gonna be easy. I do this all the time. All right, go like this, go like this. Go up like that. Okay. Okay. All right. I think we get it. It looks like shit, but that's all right. Put it up here. I got to figure this out. I, like I said, I had it figured out before, but the page layout changes once you start fucking streaming. All right. Back to this excellent adventure. I'm towing college and my college full of say right, enemy lines. I don't know, man. That college is crazy. Just stay away from, like, interpretive dance class studies and... What <laughs> the garbage? Uh, you know, those classes where they were like, you know, the pyramids are really spaceships and white people are evil. Stay away from those ones. That's just to stir people up, man. Motherfucker. I'm playing this game, by the way, on like a 30-year-old NES Advantage. I found, I found at a thrift store for five bucks. The thing fucking works good. I don't know. I'm a junk collector. Are you going to vote this November? Well, I'd like to. But my past. My past haunts me. <laughs> no, I'll probably vote. Although, he's a shoe win for my state, though, man. Fucking. Or, well, I would vote for Trump, obviously. And. Did you see Hillary hocked up a fucking loogie <laughs> in her water today? It was fucking disgusting. What a pig. Unless it was just a Photoshop and I'm an idiot who got fooled. But it looked... It looked like she fucking... Hocked a fucking nasty... Fucking... I don't know what it was.
I don't think does anyone really know Hillary supporters, man? I mean I don't know. You know, over where I'm at, I mean, I'm sure I'm it's probably more of a red state here, so it's to be expected, but you never see fucking Hillary stickers or Hillary signs. Now, I seen a couple Bernie ones when that was going on, but I have yet to see a Hillary Sega Prophet says it was green. I think it's real. <laughs> oh, what a pig that lady is. You know, Hillary, haven't you been evil enough? It's catching up to you, man. Go spend the last couple years of your life sitting in the recliner watching your stories. You've done enough evil. It's never enough. And Bill Clinton looks like a fucking zombie. He looks like the first zombie in, uh, in, uh, Not a Living Dead. Do I own guns? Ho, oh, oh, ho, top secret, bro. Top secret. That's classified information. Man, I smell at this game, but I'm reading the chat. I started getting a, a talk on Hillary Clinton. And that she should go home and watch... What are them, what are them uh, old ladies watch these days? Besides lawyer commercials. <laughs> Every time I see TV in the day, it's just lawyer commercials. Must be a lot of people suing these days, man. Did you see Danzig reunited with the Misfits? No, I didn't. I, I missed that message, by the way. Having technical, technical difficulties, however you say it. Was it bad? Fuck, man. How could Danzig reunited with the Misfits ba be bad? I mean, to be fair, they weren't a they weren't a tight act back in the early '80s. They were always kind of rough. Oh, this guy. This guy thinks he's cool, man. You fucking cocksucker, motherfucker. <laughs> Do him like a piece of shit. There's video of it? Oh man, I gotta check that out. I haven't listened to probably... Shit, I haven't listened to any music really in like five years. Ever since Bolton stopped touring, I just gave up on the dream, you know? Listening to music, having a good time. This guy's an asshole. And I can see why we didn't get it over here. Boom! Motherfucker. <laughs> Don't bitch. Well, that's enough for me. I'll be going now. What? He grabbed nunchucks? The Misfits had like a million drummers. I wonder who was drumming for him. Motherfucker. <laughs> John Tesh's album is great. John Desh. Tesh. That Frankenstein headed goof. You know he's super fucking rich, John Tesh. I don't know how he does it, but he's. The drummer from Slayer. Shit, man. Talk about overkill. You don't need a drummer that good for Misfits. Hey, is this another 4-4 song? Yep. Oh, okay. You know that drum beat you played for the last song? Do the same thing. Oh, okay. I don't know, man. I kind of like Dr. Chud. I know he's a douche in real life, supposedly, but his drumming was good. That seems bass to me. <laughs> I don't know, maybe he is. He he, t he dropped out of TV and said, fuck this shit, I'm going to play my fucking flute or whatever the fuck he does. <laughs> fuck this, I'm going to play my flute. 
Hey, man. It's one thing if you quit something and, and do what you want and you actually made something. Of yourself. I mean, I guess. I think he owns radio stations, though. <laughs> City equals Baltimore. Or, uh, Ferguson. Look, no one even gives a shit back there. I'd at least turn my head. They're just sitting there smoking and shit. I don't, I don't know what, he did something, but he's super rich. I mean, the only thing I remember him from, wasn't he the, the fucking meatball head from, uh, Entertainment Tonight? John Tesh. How the hell do we get talking about John Tesh? <laughs> Bundy took dumps on his Ferguson, but whoosh. I haven't seen Married with Children in probably 20 fucking years. Now Kelly Bundy got her fucking tit bags chopped off. Ain't fair. Now she looks like a mannequin when she takes her shirt off. I'm getting my ass kicked. I didn't deserve this. I'm an American. Yeah, fuck off, rats. I don't know you, man. What the hell? Satan is shit. This is like... This is like where Hanford lives. Are these the same, like, four guys are gonna send at me throughout the whole game? <laughs> I, you know, the American thing is just a joke. I'm an American. I don't know. I stole it from something. I don't know what it was. It's a Jewish temple. Oh, yeah. That is six-sided. That's a creepy Jewish temple. <laughs> Got fucking goat heads hanging and shit. Masons now. It's, it's Jews. It's Masons. I think it's the Shriners. I think it's the motherfucking Shriners of the Lions Club. <laughs> it's the fucking Lions, man. Or what was Fred Flintstone part of? The Grand the Grand, Pabu, uh, Grand Puba or whatever the fuck. Definitely has a Fred Flintstone theme going. The foreskin biting. <laughs> That's so gross. I'm digging this shitty Nintendo Advantage controller, man. I got a stupid uh, USB thing to put at the end of it so it works on your computer. It's tiny. That's what's nice about it. And for fighting, you know, these stupid games, it's, it works. I don't know why I just thought I'd ramble on for a minute. I don't fucking know. Leave me alone. What an adventure. Advanced control still holds up? Yeah, you should have seen it, man. It looked like someone fucking puked and shit in the thing. And, uh, I took it home and I doused it. <laughs> I doused it in, like, alcohol and Windex. Cleaned all this shit off. And the thing works, like, brand new. It's fucking crazy. I think the kid bought it, right? He got it for Christmas. He opened the box up, saw it, shit on it, puked on it, and then put it in his closet for 25 years. Because the thing works brand new. It's insane. Mine's downstairs. Well, if you haven't got the USB thing. I'm not really a collector. So I stick with more emulation type stuff. But, uh. I mean, I have some stuff. I have a Nintendo uh, handful of shit. 
but I don't go looking on eBay for this shit. I just, if I find it, if I find it outside, like in a dumpster or something, I'll grab it. Uh, plus, I'm more of an arcade guy. Can't have a, can't have a house full of arcades. That'd just be silly. What do you think of the mini NES that's coming out? I think it's fucking awesome. I want to get one. And I know people say, you well, you could just emulate it. Yeah, but it's fucking cool, man. And the controllers look awesome, too. Get collecting arcade boards? Yeah, screw that. And then fix it, fixing them, and then fixing CRTs? No thanks. I don't need that. I don't need that in my life. Although, it's cool to check out how people do it, though. I just, not for me. Mod chip plus burn discs, master race, at least when it comes to disc based systems. Wait. Wait. I don't know. Never minded anything. Unless it's like. Well, what did I do? I forget. I always forget which system. I, I taped the tab down on a disc system so I could disc swap. Was that Saturn? Might have been Saturn. Oh, and Dreamcast too, I think. This swap on that shit. Free game. <laughs> Fix the CRT, get killed by capacitors. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm simple folk. I don't need to be doing that shit. Frying myself. Look at this doctor, man. That's Hanford. Motherfucker. I guess I should have picked a, a better game, huh? But that's what happens when you're like, hey, I'll stream something real quick. You end up playing Riot City and questioning your existence. Don't be a dick, doctor. Yeah, finally. Fucking... Fucking YouTube, man. Holy shit. They, they got me twice in like the same week. So like I had to be really careful with the stupid strikes. And like the strikes were nothing. Like they said it was bullying, but I w wasn't even like mentioning people by name. <clears throat> One was from a surveillance videotape that was all over the news sites and I just dubbed it. I got a fucking strike for that. It's like, really? Uh, and my response was, you fuck, that, that, that shit's all over fucking YouTube. You're gonna come, out, come down on me on that? And then they, they still denied it. And then I got another one. And then I got another one. I forget what that, I think it was making fun of the Slaytons. Which, eh, whatever. Maybe, maybe that's true. I did deserve that one. But my my appeal to that was, just go fuck yourselves. I wrote, go fuck yourselves. Because appeals never work. Ever. Ever. Fucking appeal system, my asshole. Get out of here, you doctor, doctor douche. <laughs> Oh, I told him. I, I just come up with this stuff, people. Round four, everybody. I gotta get some of my sweet drink over here. Stay away while I drink my sweet drink. Timmy Slate before it wants to. Hey, look, I gotta be careful. I gotta mind my P's and Q's. But I will say, that forehead is something, something to behold. <laughs> it looks like an alien's gonna pop out of that fucking thing. I bet the Antichrist is incubating <laughs> that fucking forehead. Do you think she likes the headbutt like Wesley Willis? Crystal Pepsi is back? What the fuck, man? That shit was good. It was like Pepsi without the stomach aches. 
Amy. Yeah, well, Amy don't have the star power that old uh, Tammy has. That Tammy was something special. Rock and roll McDonald's. Lick a honey badger's ass. He's dead. <laughs> I think. Wesley Willis is dead. Dicks out for Wesley Willis. I must have missed that. That whole dicks out for Harambe thing. I don't get it. But I'm getting old and slow in my noodler. You know what I mean? I can't keep up to what you kids, what you kids are up to these days. Yeah, this game kind of smells. The backgrounds are cool, though. I mean, I guess. What year is this? It's a norm. <laughs> Mimi. Is that how it is? Meme. Mimi. That's a word I could say. That's probably the first time I've ever said that word in my life. At least out loud. I forgot shot at the local zoo again. Poor little guy. Always up to some shenanigans for that little feller. Have you seen Humongous? Oh, that bitch was crazy, man. Poor Humongous. He was just making a lighthearted joke. And of course the crazy feminist thinks he's talking about his Johnson. Now if he said Hugh Johnson, she might have a point. But he said humongous. The Ayatollah of rock and roller. He seems like a reasonable man. All she had to do was walk away. He seems like a reasonable man. <laughs> Come on, that humongous guy was terrible. I don't know. I'm not defending the guy, I just thought that bitch was loony. And I wanted to make a bunch of uh, stupid road warrior jokes. So thank you for that, humongous. Humongous, Lord of the Wasteland. Humongous rules the wasteland. <laughs> I think every 80s arcade game kind of ripped off Road Warrior. Even this one. There's Road Warrior in here somewhere. What was that dog food's name in that movie where they're all fighting over the dog food? It was like Dinky D or something. A can of Dinky D. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's cool. Motherfucker, I wanted my camera. I don't know how to play this. I'm sure I'm doing something wrong. What was that humongous guy thing about anyway with that feminist flipping out? <sighs> this game. It's the same four guys over and over again. I mean, what's there is cool. There's just not enough of it. It just seems like a really watered down... I don't know, final fight I guess. I was gonna say Streets of Rage, but not even that. It's Hanford that felt the most grief. Well, Hanford. I was reminded that a great man once said, Shut up, Hanford. If 
Fighting Force for the PC and oh, I've had it for PlayStation. That was a good game. Only two players though. One player was Dulls. It was it was Snoozeville. I hate to use harsh, critical language of a good game, but two players great. One player kind of Dullsville, You know what I mean? Poor fella. <laughs> Hanford's tough. Even for a tender little goth. Alien vs. Predator, Punisher. Oh, that's the good shit, man. I'm just a sucker for old school Final Fight, man. That's probably my favorite one. Besides the original Double Dragon. That one's the best. Because you could jump on boxes and shit, man. Climb ladders. Can't climb ladders in Final Fight. Look at that guy standing. <laughs> oh. Oh, come here, big boy. Oh. Watch, I get a strike for that. Insensitive. Everything sucks now. YouTube sucks. You know, YouTube, it was basically, you could say whatever the fuck you wanted. Just no nudity. Which is fine, because, hey. there's If you want nudity on the internet, it's all over the place. You're bullying this poor fight. You're bullying those fictional characters. See how he was leaning? Such strength. Such pride. Go smell an ace. Motherfucker. How many quarters have I put in this stupid game? The milking videos that are on YouTube. Yeah, you know, I'll see those. Someone will post those somewhere and I'll see them and I'll be like, man, I just got strikes for saying something. And there's this lady, like, fucking whipping her tit out for a 13 year old kid. It just seems wrong. And of course, I'm exaggerating, but the kid's like seven. It's a gross. Burning fight. That's a Neo Geo one. That's a weird one. It's a pretty good one, though. Neo Geo is the goo shit, man. Get out of here. Oh, nah. It's the same guys over and over again. Like, if I was the guy who designed the backgrounds for this game, I'd be like, can't you guys liven it up? I did my part, because the backgrounds for the time are nice. God, get away from me. Ah! I mentioned I'm bad at video games. Shock Troopers is awesome. I haven't played that one in years. I should play that one again. That out of here, man. Nah, just women caressing boobs and milking no kids. <laughs> no, I haven't seen that, but that's... That's odd. You know, I, these, this is not stuff I look for, you know what I mean? It's just stuff like someone will be like, look what they're posting on YouTube. And I'll see it and I'm like, whoa. I'm gonna look up milk tits. Not saying you do that. <laughs> uh, he did a video recently, but it sucked. It was like him pretending he had friends, the food reviewer. Oh, well. Let him have, let him have his, uh, his fantasy. How do I donate? I have a hundred dollars. There's no donation here, man. I'm not some Twitch queer. Hey, you know, it's funny. Everything on Twitch sounds like a fucking, uh, um, um, uh, what is it? What are those things? Those fundraiser shows. A telethon? Yeah, like a telethon. Every asshole's begging for money. And it's like, motherfucker, you're playing on a better computer than I got. You want money? Go oh, suck a dick. I ain't giving you nothing to play a video game. And now it's like whores. I never really liked Twitch because you can never get a... At least for me, where I'm at, I can't get a good stream on it. Everything is choppy. 
Now, like, the, not to speed run, but just, like, every every channel is just begging for money. I remember, like, I gave it, like, three chances. I was watching one guy. I forget what he was playing. You know, I'll watch some guy play some, like, old old games. That's kind of like, like, if I'm bored, you know, like, there's, like, nothing else to watch. And every one, the guy, like, starts out, like, begging for money for a half hour. It's like, go fuck yourself, dude. It's just playing a fucking... You're just playing a fucking video game. Man, you get fucking ass raped over here. It's like one of Hanford's pornos. One dollar asks me a question. I ain't charging no money. Don't try to make me look like a scumbag. I'm just a tender little guy. Playing the stupid Nintendo NES Advantage. Drinking a soda pop. Girls get money on Twitch because of titties. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. That shit, that shit's got to be a bubble, right? Like, eventually it's going to be like, wait a minute. You mean I'm throwing money to people to play video games? What, am I retarded? And, like, everyone's going to have that sudden realization and just the bottom's going to fall out. Mike Matei does that. <laughs> that guy's the biggest fucking turd. He's begging for money? What the fuck, dude? It's, 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 it's like rich motherfucker. Cause you know he makes some good money off those, off YouTube, you know what I mean? And he's begging for money on Twitch. I'm not saying he's rich, but it's like, what, this, this is what it is now? Now the middle class people are begging for money? <laughs> it's fucking ridiculous. Mike Matei would have heard. <laughs> I can't believe that guy's begging for money. Everything about that guy's a, that guy's a fucking turd. Come on. Holy shit. Miney crafted that guy who put that video where it like it turns red and starts screaming. I'm really not paying attention to this game at this point. <laughs> That's the funniest fucking thing. Oh my god. This guy, fuck off. Man. Well, I'm just gonna run away because he's gonna hit me. What the fuck? You fat bastard. Alright, I'm gonna try going diagonal. Wow. I had invincibility for a minute there. There you fat fuck. Do I have to wait for him to belly flop? Is that my strategy? Oh! I figured it out. I'm the champion. Cocksucker. Get up, you fat fuck. I'm triggered by this gameplay. Yes. I should have put a trigger warning. Involves fat guys with heart tattoos. That's personally one of my triggers. Although that cape is pretty sweet. What does the A stand for? Ace hole? Yeah, I just came up with that. Motherfucker. He has gravy in his veins. Oh. <laughs> is that it? Is that the end? Come on. Or is like the end boss gonna be some like stupid dragon or something? Have you ever had a fat person step on the back of your shoe? I don't know. Random question. No. Why is a fat person walking that close to you, man? That's kind of creepy. See how red boog boogie... <laughs> I did a video on that slob on uh, Daily Motion, and, and like for me, like, because I'm a nobody, that got a shit ton of views. And, you know, it was basically just him, like, whining about shit in himself. That got, like, a couple thousand, I think. His face was all... Yeah, that guy's done. He had fucking DDP come to his house and get him off his ass to try to get him to a... Let's <laughs> wait. No. Not even a celebrity can get... Well, I mean, a C-list celebrity. A D-list. But even a D-lister can't get that slob off. Off his ass.
You know, it's like fat guys always start out funny, right? Like, that's a pretty funny fat dude. But then it slowly turns to depression. <laughs> every time. Every time a fat dude's involved. Think of every fat comedian. It starts out all nice and fun. And boy, does it end bad. Every time. Like, Chris Farley. With foam coming out of his mouth. That awesome photo of him dead in his... His apartment. If you've never seen the Chris Farley foam photo, boy, he went out. He went out with a bang. What a party. True, in the beginning, he was broke and funny. Yeah, look, fat, <clears throat> those fat guys, man. And then it slowly turns to, I can't lose weight. I've been trying to lose weight, but everything I do, I fail. I'm eating nothing, I swear. And that becomes their whole identity from being funny. And <laughs> just being a, a fucking depressing, bloated sack of shit. Now he's just a good... Yeah, whining. Like, crying. Yeah, well, there was one where he cried. Now look, I only, I only catch the highlights of this crap. I don't watch these guys' channels. But when I see Fat Guy crying, I think Comedy Gold, and I had to check that one out. YouTube didn't save his life. What? How about a burger? Boogie says YouTube saved his life. Why? Because, hey, let me tell you. Is there's YouTube, right? He's sitting on his ass in front of a computer. Without YouTube, he'd be sitting on his ass in front of a computer. Saved his life. Get the fuck out of here. Always so dramatic with these fat fucks. And I don't hate the guy. It's just, dude, every fat guy turns, turns into this. He bolts his eyes out. Yeah, and fat guys cry a lot, man. I don't know. What is that? Lack of testosterone or something? Because you're like so fat it cuts your balls off. And then you just start crying and blubbering all the time. <laughs> I'm trying to catch up these comments. But it's so much karate fight in action that I'm barely paying attention to. I'm just kind of off in my own world. I like my own world. It's the energy in their fat water retention. That boogie guy is some gold digger that came around as soon as he got a following. Yeah, and you know she's fucking the neighbor. Allegedly. Allegedly, everybody. Everything I said tonight is allegedly, if I didn't mark that. I am a high-profile target, and I must protect myself. <laughs> Imagine someone's... Suing some retarded YouTube streamer because he didn't say allegedly. All those lawyer commercials that Beefneck watches. I'm surprised I didn't get nailed. Porter <laughs> fucking. Yeah, what is this? Am I supposed to like. Is this supposed to be like modern art where I'm supposed to piece the story together from the backgrounds? And where the hell did that creepy. That creepy temple pool. What was that all about? That Satanist place. Maybe it makes sense. When you see a bunch of TVs, though, you know fucking something's coming. Something's gonna come on the TVs. Uh. What now? Oh, am I supposed to move? I thought I was supposed to wait by the TVs. <laughs> CRT. I know. What a waste. You know, kids today will never see the uh, fucking a shitload of TVs, uh, old school TVs stacked up like that. Unless I'm totally speaking out of my ass and they do it with LCDs, which is probably the case. I'm good at speaking out of my ass. I was expecting Shredder, I was. Or at least a Shredder equivalent. Hey Richie, why did the chain change? I remember when you were my ass's worms. 
I don't know, because that's more of a statement than a name. And I just wanted to see if I could do it. It's not like my channel was setting the world on fire anyway, so I didn't have any, any strong feelings towards it. I'm just a tender old guy, man. I think I could still change it if I wanted to, but why bother? Who gives a shit? The same four guys. It's like they got a loser factory and they just keep pumping them out. We got spiky haired McOne sleeve. And we got cowboy hat McGurk. And we got tight, tight pants Jones. What's your daily job, man? It's classified. I work for, I work for the shadow government. Secret missions and such. I would tell you, but <laughs> you know the rest. I ain't showing the mouse, is it, motherfucker? Why couldn't someone said Richie, your mouse is showing? Richie, your mouse is showing. Just let me fucking hang like that, like a big dumb asshole. Why is it showing the mouse anyway? Fuck. It does have some cool backgrounds, but now we're in the most boring background ever. Ooh, it's Skid, Skids Pants McGillicuddy. Remember in the 80s, the Skids? They're like the ugliest pants ever. I had a gym teacher that wore Skids. Solving world conflicts. Hillary for president. Whatever, dude. We got paid chills in here? I must be getting big. No, no one likes Hillary. Everyone knows this. No one... No one likes Hillary. It's just like... It is kind of like Final Fight's level. How about I get to kick a guy out of a fucking window? At least Final Fight had a payoff. Oh, don't mind me, guys. I'm going to drink some coffee off the floor. Oh, shit. Oh. Where's the window? You got me excited. Let's see. Can you do the one-hit trick? I don't think you could do that in this one. Let's see. Where you cheese him? Nah. Unless I'm doing it wrong, which may be the case. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm a cruise missile. <laughs> that shit always makes me laugh. Especially when he fucking gave up. Like two months later, people are saying, I'm a cruise missile now. <laughs> uh, fucking t Ted Cruz self-destructed so bad, man. He was like the big tea party guy. <clears throat> I never liked him when I saw that weasel up there with Rand Paul where he was sitting there rambling. I don't know what the fuck. I forget. It was like some like 24 hour thing where they were sitting up there rambling trying to stop something. I got the memory of a goldfish. But I just remember he looks like a guy constantly holding back a shit. Yeah, you can't run for politics if you got holding back shit face. That should be a fucking requirement. Nah, dude, you meet all the requirements, but it looks like you're holding back a shit. No. Oh. <laughs> the delicate stuff. He's still trying. He's still thinking of a way with that horrible wife of his. <clears throat> I picture Ted Cruz's wife constantly going, Arr. Right, honey? Arr. <laughs> hey, I'm doing Simpsons impressions. I'm just like you fucking rubes. Wasn't there some fat chick who looked like Ted Cruz? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> Did she do the porn? Because <clears throat> I gotta see that. I gotta see what that bitch looks like. For the goof, obviously. I mean, I can control myself. Don't you worry. I gotta see Ted, Ted Cruz's face getting porked. Who <laughs> would do it? Come here, Ted Cruz's face. Wasn't she like English? 
Everyone likes Donald Trump. People who say they don't are just lying. Or don't, or don't know anything about him. And look at the alternatives. Hillary Clinton, Jeb Bush, it was just a... I mean, you'd have an argument to say that everyone running was shit. I mean, Jeb, Jeb, what a fucking turd. Mexican people don't? Yeah, but why? And that's... Not all Mexican people hate Trump. Yeah, you can like Trump without liking his policies. <laughs> He's hilarious. I don't know, man. Someone's got to take control of that border, though. That shit. And it's not just Mexicans, either. It's just, man, anyone could just come here and just fucking say, Oh, I live here now. I mean, come on. Would you leave your door open in your house? Would you leave it open all the time? And just say, hey, come on in. I don't think so. I don't think so at all. Thank you very much. How dare you? How dare you question me? Bernie was a bigger joke than Jeb. Yeah, Bernie was a fuck. I, I didn't. That's one I didn't understand at all. I mean, I'd I'd vote for Hillary before Bernie. <laughs> Bernie was crazy. That communist shit, man. That never works out right. Free college. Well, if the government would stop paying for fucking college loans, the prices wouldn't go up high, you fucking idiot. Ah. How dare you. How dare you. Leo's gonna be shot in the ocean with a catapult. I wouldn't, I wouldn't fight you on that one. Trump will make Hillary have a nervous breakdown. Yeah, well, you see, they canceled the debates. Like, no, they're having the debates, but it's more like a dual town hall where they don't go back and forth. So, I mean, dude, this is totally a sham. The media totally killed themselves on this. As if one thing Trump's good at, it's, it's fucking making an ass of the person he's arguing with. And she, yeah, she don't want any part of that. Bernie gave everyone free money. Bernie, just, he was just in it for the money, man. He spent like, he got millions and spent nothing. Oh, come on, man. Jesus. How many guys you get to dump on me? Seriously, man? Yeah, I think you're right, Hillary. It, it's it's totally... Now they're saying Homeland Security's taking over the voting. So, I mean, it, it's all a big fucking fraud. But, it, you know, what's better, though? It, it's, it's a fraud. It's in front of everyone's face. So, I mean... At least... At least it's not a handful of us sitting around like, Hey, we're getting fucked. Everyone's gonna know we're getting fucked this time. Oh, it's fine. Why worry about it? Oh, the government stole the election. So what? Wanna move? Don't move to Canada, man. Canada's just as bad. I don't know why people think Canada's so great. I'm not saying it's bad. I'm saying we're all in the same shit, shit pile <laughs> trying to get out. All right, so we got fancy pants with the sword here. Please tell me I get to kick him through the window. I don't ask for much. Just maybe some window kicking. Bernie bought a $600,000 house. Ugh. And how many people, you know how many people probably called that, man, that he was just gonna, he's just gonna fucking take the money and run. Canada basically almost has thought crime laws. Yeah, I mean, it's not good over there either. They got problems. We got problems. Shit, man. I saw I saw one guy build himself an island out of garbage. <laughs> and every day, that's looking like a better idea. I'm going to make myself my, my garbage island and set sail.
Oh, the country's going to shit? Oh, <laughs> sucks to be you guys. I'm out of here. Hop on my garbage island. And float to peace and prosperity. For all, which is me. Like he planted grass over his garbage pile. It was amazing. Not outsourcing the job starts from there. <laughs> Yeah, that whole outsourcing thing is not really working good. It works good for certain people. The 1%, dude! Shut up. 1%. Man, Dick. His, his name is Dick. <laughs> the garbage island that floats the seven seas. <laughs> Garbage so <to> Australia. <laughs> well that that is the wasteland that humongous rules. I'm trying to keep up with the comments. Also I'm bad at games too. I'm not trying to make excuses. Let's see what does that say? In an alternate dimension, Birdie brought a bunch of Starbucks and Tum. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bernie's shit. Remember that stupid bird thing? Wow, a bird. Wow, a bird was trying to pick your old bones. Thought you were a mummy. Dick, I've had it with you. Get out of here, Dick. Dick? Dick! Come on, that didn't kill him? Motherfucking dick. Alright, dick. Get over here. Get fucked, dick. <laughs> like, <laughs> he does look like half a skin. He's this very skinny little feller. Oh, there he is. I didn't even get to kick him out of the window. Get the fuck out of here. The drug syndicate, MID, has been destroyed by activities of two detectives. From this day on, the riot city changed itself into a peaceful city without violence. For their courage, Xi, Xi. Huh? What? What an adventure, everybody. Kana sucks ass, especially even more now because of that fruit Justin Trudeau. <laughs> Wasn't Bernie Sanders Sanders rapping? Oh man, please tell me he did that. Bernie Sanders. Man, what a stupid game. Bobby, that's second player. We never got to see Bobby. But I'll give you a little spoiler, he walks like a chicken. For some reason. For some reason he walks like a chicken. <laughs> What the fuck does ZZ mean? Presented by Sega and West One. What an adventure. Those are pronouns. <laughs> they have pronouns. And on that note, I gotta get going. I'll see you guys later, man.